Hello boys and girls, Buster out here and welcome back to Armor Races. Today we are taking a look at the newest 1.5 update. First of all, in this update we have two new vehicles, the T-80U, which is the tier 6 Russian modern tank, you can see it on screen right now. It is absolutely beautiful tank, as you can see, and it is not only good looking, but it performs very good in battle as well and uh, I have one game with this tank coming right up so stay tuned for that now the next vehicle which was introduced for the NATO is the new tier 6 NATO modern tank the Challenger 2 which is as well an incredibly well looking machine and uh, I'm proud that uh, I'm now an owner of one of those machines. So as you can see the model right there, uh, absolutely beautiful uh, tank. And it's a very good uh, performing machine into battle as well. So I will be doing tank review on this tank and on the Mighty Mouse this weekend so stay tuned for that now also one more thing that is new to the game is this little effect when you buy a new tank there we go as you can see there when I bought my challenger 2 I was uh, surprised nicely by this new effect and I think that's a pretty cool change when you buy a tank that you anticipated long time okay so this is the game which I have uh, recorded for today's video as you can see the controls are a bit changed there is now firing button and I'm not sure uh, if you could change back to the old firing uh, because I don't find the button being so convenient but anyways uh, the v-pad is different as well and uh, we ha have a new uh, aiming reticule, if I can call it like that. Uh, we now have a live bar and a reload bar, which uh, we can track our hit points and uh, the remaining time of our reload. And uh, as you will be able to see in this game, uh, the T-80U performs really really good it is able to reach just below 60 km per hour when it has the fuel level 3 and this means that it's a pretty fast tank like pretty much all the uh, modern tanks were as you can see it can really shift around the battlefield which is a great thing because you can easily uh, change position and there you can see the lovely damage per shot of 602 in the flank of this challenger and three shots in and he's on 200 hit points already look at this DPM it's just hilarious now I should say that uh, the T-80U has nice gun depression as well as you can see here it's not brilliant but it's definitely not a uh, terrible gun depression as you can see I'm just able to uh, put shots behind this ridge which is you know not brilliant but it is more than the some of the other Russian mediums not mediums sorry moderns well I'll be doing tank review on this tank as well but as I mentioned before first of all make tank review on the Challenger 2 and uh, on the mouse because I've promised you a tank review on the mouse and I still haven't done it so I guess I will be making up for this and now we're in a duel against the challenger too but we had the help of our teammate and we had more hit points so we killed him and uh, as you can see it is very easy to play in those tanks and it's very fun very funny as well so 
I will highly recommend getting one of those as soon as you uh, collect the money you need or if you have the money just don't uh, you know don't wonder which of the two tanks to buy they are both amazing tanks and whichever you buy you will be satisfied I can guarantee this and now only two enemies remain and we are four so I guess we have this battle uh, now so there we go the last enemy should die pretty soon I managed to plant another shot in his flank something really silly is about to happen though there we go I bounced off the flank of this tank which is pretty funny and sorry but I don't have the post game results uh, my stupid editing uh, deleted them so don't worry I did a uh, 6300 damage in this game and uh, I'm not sure how many kills I picked but I guess you can count them if you are really interested in this so there we go this is the 1.5 update a pretty nice update brings us two more uh, tanks in the cosmetical change of the aiming reticule now I've I've been taking a small break from this game but now I'm starting again with the videos so uh, if you had been waiting for me to start again there you go I hope you uh, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed and uh, leave a like down below if you did make sure to ask me something in the comments if you need to know something and if you haven't already subscribed go ahead and subscribe if you want to watch more tank videos and you if you have already subscribed thank you for watching and good luck on the battlefield